There's a lot of technology in this small tap. Every tap is an individual computer offering the user an infinite amount of usability. Every tap has selectable portion control. Each switch position, two, three, can be programmed to anything you want. So for example, you don't necessarily need to have a one ounce, two ounce, three ounce. This can be a quarter ounce, this can be two and a half ounce, this can be 3.45 ounces. But in more of a common use, you would use this something like this. If you had a high-end McAllen's, you might only have a one and a quarter ounce pour in your position one. And then the other two may be blank, or to make it easier for your bartenders so they can't mess up, you might have all three positions as one and a quarter ounce pour. Every time somebody pours, the computer registers that the pour has been made. you'll see that, that we have an image that pops up on the screen. This connection is made within 300 feet of the transceiver here that can be easily mounted and hidden so that no bartender or service person knows what it is. Every time you pour, you can pour more than once once the bottle is inverted. So for example, I'm gonna do a double shot here. One, it's going to stop for a second and then pour once again. Again, every time pouring, it goes into the computer. It's now one o'clock in the morning, or two o'clock in the morning, and I want to shut the bar down. I press bar off, go to pour, nothing will pour. Your bar is shut down for the night, and none of your bartenders can pour anybody, limiting your legal liability for serving after hours. Now, next day, you come in, or you can do this remotely through your through the internet. Bar is back on. And now your your bar is on and you're controlling your bar. We have two levels of security with DigiTab to ensure that your bartenders cannot remove the taps without you knowing. First level is a pressure switch on the bottom of every tap. That when depressed, when placing it on a bottle, it tells the software that it has been placed on a new bottle, and when it's taken off, it tells it that it's been taken off a bottle. That's first level of security. Second level of security utilizes our security seal tape. The seal tape goes around the legs of the tap, connecting the tap to the bottle. If the seal is tampered with, if the seal is tampered with, it changes color. I'll do that again to show you that it changes color. Reporting is extensive when using the DigiTap system. This can be connected to your POS and done in your POS or just through our standalone software if you want to use a separate. For example, if I would like to see a daily report, I press daily report and it'll automatically generate a report. Now my bar is kind of small here, but you can see that we have size, number of pours, consumption in ounces, and dollar value. You'll be putting in dollar value for every pour, like a, a, as a PLU, like you would in your POS. This will also interact with your computer, uh, with your POS to make it uh, correlate. Battery levels can be checked in the software, so if you have a very large system, you can see all the battery levels within the entire space. So for example, at Yankee Stadium, we have 2,500 taps, 20 bars, 54 bartenders, and it was a challenge for them to be able to see all the batteries in this giant stadium. So what we created was the software feature that allows you to check battery levels in the software. Battery report, it's easy to generate. You go to custom reports, you select spout battery level, and it tells me that I've got a full battery on my on my kettle one. These two have not uh, registered because they're not connected to the system right now, and that these two also are full. Batteries last 1,500 to 3,000 pours depending on the viscosity. 
which means that vodka is going to be more on the 3,000 side and a more higher viscosity liquor, higher sugar level is going to be on the 1,500 side. Batteries are easily removed from the waterproof cap on the bottom of the tap. They are a one inch lithium battery you can find online for about $1.50, $1.25 a piece. And they're very easily removed and replaced. In addition to price levels that we've talked about already, we also have happy hour times. Happy hours can be set easily by just going into the setup mode, into happy hours, and generating any kind of happy hour time you'd like to have. Programming a spout. Programming a spout is extremely easy. I'm going to do a short demonstration here. You go to setup, spout list, and I'm going to detect spout. I'll show you again. Detect spout. It says switch the spout from three to off. I switch the spout from three to off. The off will then light up longer than it usually would and tell me this is an absolute and it tells me all the switch positions that, it, that it's set for. If I would like to change that, I can just use the drop down menu, pick out a different amount or a different liquor, press update <laughs> spout, three, off, and it's updated. DigiTap will increase your profits. That's the most important part. We want to make you more money at your bar. The easiest way for me to tell you that it will increase your profits is to say that it'll be 10 to 30% more than what you're doing presently. But to make it more specific, I can say to you that you're going to gain four to seven more shots at least per bottle that you're going to get paid for. So if you charge $10 a shot to make it easy, that means that in less than two bottles, or two bottles and a half if you even charge a little bit less, you're gonna make back the price of the tap. Now this doesn't include the decrease in liquor purchasing you're going to have, which is also gonna make you more money. Overall, DigiTap is an amazing product that will increase your profits and make your life easier at your bar. For more information, call DigiTap at 800-994-4799. Thank you.